Ah. Welcome, YouTube. There we go, the paper's on the screen. My new story, about one life to live. Another new story. A sad new story. Actually, not sad, it's just questions. Question one. When will John find out that Brody has his son, Liam? When will he find this out? Will it be Natalie that finds out first, or John? And how will they find out? Because, of course, he did take the note, but what did he do with the note? Did he throw it away, or did he keep it? And since he asked Natalie to move in with him, I'm thinking Natalie's going to find the note in his house. And, of course, because John lives right down the hall, maybe they'll fight. Maybe John will hear it. John will come in and save the day. And even if he does find out, will John and Natalie end up together, or will John find somebody else? And will Todd be crushed? That last question, of course, was just a, a joke because Todd making the comment that he never goes home with a guy before three dates. Anyway, moving along. Will John solve the Todd mystery? How will he solve the Todd mystery? What will be the breaking clue? Or will someone else solve the Todd mystery? And of course, I'm sure when every geek is wondering, because I consider myself a One Life to Live geek now, will Todd see Star or Jack, his kids? Will Star, like, freak out? Because that's, like, that's just a moment in the show that I'd like to see. Of course, they'd put him in danger so they couldn't see him, so Todd would make sure he didn't see him or they didn't see him. But how would he react or how would they react? That's just, you know, something I'd love to see. Especially with Star's uh, cute reaction to something what's-his-name said. Damn it, now I forgot what he, uh, what he said earlier. But just she has that she has the same that's expressions. Oh, that's how they kiss in France when he when uh, the other dude uh, slipped her some tongue and she says that's not how friends kiss in France. It is cute epic look she gave him. But I just can't wait to see like the messed up face you know she has you know when she when she sees Todd. Oh well, Vicky know the truth. I don't know if I already said that, but since Vicky's kind of questioning it and looking at the old picture and when she was asked why she had the old picture, she was kind of like I don't know. Is Vicky gonna know innately that 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 the other Todd is the real Todd if she sees him? I mean, what are the answers to these questions? What do you guys think? Ah, that's right. Well, Jessica caught on, and you thought Jessica was kind of too busy with all her other personalities, Tess, uh, Ness, or whatever the guy personality was. Wes, there you go. Thank you, mom. But I, but I have to ask. That's kind of creep. That was that was the creep factor on One Life Till where I I really wouldn't watch that because when it was a chick personality, it kind of kind of made sense because I mean that that's possible. But guy personalities, it'd be kind of awkward because I was uh, you know I'd be watching the soap with my mom in the same room. It'd be kind of awkward watching two chicks kiss. Going, is this a soap or a or a? No, she was trying hey, mom. To she was trying to hit on chicks, but they're kind of just looking at her like she's weird. <laughs> that's 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 the that's the thing about soaps. What are these answers? Oh, and one life to and all my children. That's enough of one life to live. We've already gotten all those questions out of the way. Comment down below what you think is going to happen. But I had to ask a couple of questions about all my children. Ah, Doctor Dave, which I thought they pulled his license anyway. I watched another episode of that today. And I have he to gets ask. Hi, like chef. <laughs> Apparently, it's just a regular thing with Dave. He gets his license pulled. He gets it back. He gets it pulled. He gets it back. It's not. It's not a car license, people. This is a license to practice medicine. I mean, this isn't like, oh, officer, I parked in the wrong spot. Well, you know, we're taking your license. You can learn a lesson. Oh, you know what? I killed somebody. Well, you know what? No, because of your neglect. And because you experiment illegally on people, we're going to pull your medical license for just a little while. And as soon as you stop experimenting illegally on people, we'll give it back to you. No, as soon as you say something important, we'll give it back to you. Up yours. Anyway, <laughs> you can hear a comment. She keeps commenting in the background. Also, another soap I watch only because, really, two characters. It, it used to be just one, Jason, uh, General Hospital. Uh, the lug nut part. As, 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 you know, office is going to sound, I thought it was freaking, was awesome. Because she's just, I don't care what it is. It's the thought that counts in that. It's just, I think chicks think it's more cute for just, you know, the, the ring fell and he was honest. Because I was hoping to be honest. But just pulled a lug nut up. He's like, well, um, will you marry me? 
and she has a lug nut in his hand, and she's oh, that's so cute. That's because it's funny. Because it's a lug. Who proposes with a lug nut really anymore? I mean that that spontaneous, cute humor, you know, and romance just doesn't happen anymore. But uh, yeah, that too. But mainly about the one life to live thing. What what everyone thinks is going to happen. You know how they're going to find out. Now, like I said, I'm still waiting. I'm going to say it now because Natalie's moving in with Brody and Brody took the paper. It didn't say he threw it away. Natalie's going to find the paper. Yeah, my mother's going like, oh wait, like this. Oh, crap, he ripped it up. Fuck, never mind, he ripped it up in the office. Oh, and x nail on that square. But flip, we ripped it up in the office. I, I, I fell asleep during that part. So if John catches the fake tie, the fake scarf, I use that as the ace of his sleeve. Wait, okay. Oh, the fake Todd knows, obviously. And so does that other dude. Anyway, now I'm just dragging on. And uh, dragging butt, which only leaves Doodle on the carpet. Anyway. <laughs> Apparently, a lot of people know. that I can't believe the note was torn up. So if you watched all the beginning, you're going to have to forgive me for that. Now, now we're going to have to find out how he knows. How will John Natalie find out that... Brody is not the real father. And how is Brody going to leave the show? Because you know he's not going to stick around. He's not going to be a cop after everyone finds out he was such a douche. But then again, Dave can still be a doctor, apparently, after medical malpractice out the wazoo. So, who knows? Maybe he will stick around. Then he'll be elected mayor. Anywho, just want to hear what you guys have to say and how you think, uh, one, the big question, how is uh, Natalie... And uh, what's his name, uh, John, going to figure out that Liam is really their baby. Will they get back together because of this? Or is John Hart going to be taken by somebody else? Other question. Will any, are they going to show uh, Todd's kids seeing Todd so they can have a cute moment with him? Like a shock look, you know, something. Um, we've already gone over the which is the real Todd, which is the fake Todd. We're still talking about that. Um, the other question is, Vicky going to know it's him? Uh, how are they going to spin this Jessica thing? Are people going to keep asking questions? Oh, and the uh, the other Todd, well, I'm going to call him the fake Todd, the one without the scar on his face, and Thomas, are they going to end up getting too deep in the CIA stuff to get out? And will the fake Todd, a real Todd, have to save the fake Todd and his family? I cannot wait until tomorrow's episode of all... Of one life live. I was about to say all my children, but that's a totally different soap. Alright, that's all. Have a good one.